I've been collecting skateboards for about eight years now. I've been skating for about 22 years. Got a, close to 200 skateboards. These are some of them. They're all over the house. These are some of my boards and my mate's boards we rode in the late 80s, early 90s. These ones through here would have to be some of my favourites. Um, all of them are limited edition in one way or another. This is a 25th anniversary Steve Caballero, one of 500 ever made. This is one of my most unusual boards. It's actually a Ben Lexan. It's a wing skateboard. Uh, never really took off. I reckon Ben should have stuck to designing yachts. This one here is a long rider. It's actually got a handle, it's a little plastic number. Um, never really took off either. This one here is a skate bike. It's a cross in between a unicycle and a skateboard. Uh, pretty unusual, pretty rare to find. This one here is an all-terrain board. It uh, goes on gravel, grass, concrete, wherever you want to go. It actually comes with a brake and it's actually one of my favourites to ride. Uh, a lot of them I brought them because I wanted them when I was a kid but I couldn't have them. And now I can, I've got the money. Uh, recently I paid $300 for a used board from 1986. It's this one here, it's actually exactly the same as the one I had when I was a kid. I always said it, if I saw one I'd buy it. Sort of collected these ones because of the graphic and I like the style of board. This one here is um, probably one of, probably my rarest board. If it was in um, mint condition it would uh, roughly be worth two and a half thousand dollars. Yeah a lot of my friends do like skateboards. Um, they might have four or five. They don't have anywhere near as many as I do. It's always good when someone comes around and they can reminisce about oh, I had that board or oh, I had that board. Also collect skate shoes including shoes that match some of the boards I've got. Like these Steve Caballero vans that match the Steve Cab Pow. Um, to tell you the truth, I don't think I'll ever actually wear them. Started collecting t-shirts a few years ago. Um, all skate shirts. This one, I actually saw it on a guy at the pub. Uh, roughly 20 minutes later, I talked him out of his shirt off his back. I've been hit by f three or four cars broken a few bones, just the general thing, lost a lot of skin over the years, but it's, yeah, it's all part of the fun. Really like changing the uh, setup on different boards, trying different wheels, different trucks, uh, makes a big difference to how the actual board rides. It's not just about collecting them, um, I've got like quite a few that I ride on rotation and uh, it's yeah, my form of transport. It's definitely cheaper than petrol, red gel and all the other things and yeah, if you're doing something good for the environment, it's an added bonus really. It's still a rush, um, yeah, it makes you feel alive.